The high school football season kicks off tonight, but one team often overlooked officials. There's a shortage of referees across the San Antonio area and the state. RJ Marquez spoke to the local chapter of officials about why many refs are leaving the profession and how it's affecting the action on the field. Dave Maxwell is entering his 30th season as a Texas high school football official. It's a brotherhood and, and the reason at the end of the day, why I do it is because the other guys on the field with me. Maxwell is the vice president of the San Antonio chapter of the Texas Association of Sports Officials. As the association gets ready for its new season, they're doing it with smaller numbers. We have a, a new member class in San Antonio of, of 60 officials. At the end of the first year, that group of 60 will probably be down to 30. Maxwell says the main reason it's been difficult to keep officials coming back is verbal abuse from fans, coaches, and players. It's become uncomfortable at times. Yelling, you know, that, that you think that was a holding call in the stands versus following the officials to their car is crossing a line. And Dave tells us that this chapter of TASO covers 116 high schools all the way from Gonzales stretching to Eagle Pass and Del Rio. And right now there is a shortage of 100 officials locally and 900 across the state. The average age of San Antonio officials is close to 60, but TASO is making efforts to recruit younger officials and more women. It's a program that the state office has put together um, and uh, it's called uh, WOW women officials working. We also have a task force for recruiting and retention. Maxwell knows that fans and coaches are passionate, but he also wants them to be respectful. It doesn't need to be threats of violence. Tonight's the first varsity game of the season, but my crew started working football back in March. RJ Marquez, KSAT 12 News.